From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us. It's Friday, February 20th, 2015. Leading our update, a North Pole man turned himself in Wednesday evening after allegedly shooting and killing another male. 41-year-old Matthew Davis of North Pole is currently in custody, charged with first-degree murder of 34-year-old John Adam Chicolte of North Pole. According to a release, Davis broke into a residence, ran upstairs, and shot Chicolte several times. Troopers received a call reporting a home invasion. The caller was hiding when Chicolte was shot. Davis then left the residence in his vehicle. Alaska Governor Bill Walker says he plans to increase the viability of an in-state natural gas pipeline project. The in-state Alaska standalone pipeline has been seen as a fallback should the major liquefied natural gas project the state is pursuing with pipeline and oil and gas companies falter. Walker said the administration would pursue both and whichever was first to produce a solid plan with terms acceptable to the state would get full state support. Or he said the two might be combined. And Governor Walker announced the appointment of three new members to the Alaska Gas Line Development Corporation yesterday, including former State Senator Joe Paskvan of Fairbanks. Paskvan joins Rick Halford of Dillingham and Hugh Short of Anchorage as appointees to the board, which oversees efforts to develop liquefied natural gas in Alaska. They replaced three previous members who were dismissed by Walker in the name of transparency in negotiations. Quick look at the Fairbanks weather today, partly cloudy, highs in the mid-20s to lower 30s. Tonight, partly cloudy in the evening, then becoming mostly cloudy with lows in the teens to mid-20s. Tomorrow, mostly cloudy with highs in the upper 30s to lower 40s. Extended forecast is mostly cloudy Sunday. Chance of snow Monday through Wednesday. Highs through the period staying in the 35 to 40 range. Air index moderate in Fairbanks and North Pole, and the Aurora forecast is quiet. That's all we have for right now. Glad you could join us. And remember, for more news, sports, or weather, download our free mobile app for Android and Apple devices. From all of us here at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching. Enjoy your day and have a great weekend.